Hello, dear viewer, and welcome to this Let's Try of Dark Mist on iOS. With me, gentlemen. It's $3.99 in the App Store right now. I believe I got it on sale um, a while ago. <laughs> but it's a roguelike deck builder with waves of enemies. As you lose health, you lose access to your cards, and you just keep going as long as you can, I think. Let's try the standard mode for now. This is my first time turning it on. Berserker, Bugmaster, Prophet, Chaos Knight, Beastmaster... Okay, so they've got a lot of different classes. All right, let's go with difficulty level one on the Berserker, because that's all we have access to. Using cards consumes energy. Okay. Usually only enemies in the front row can attack you, and you can attack enemies in the front row. Defeat the enemy with a question mark on their head to trigger an event. Oh, that's interesting. What do you do? This enemy gains iron defense for this turn, triggered when the enemy enters the front row. The enemy only loses one health point when hit by an attack. Okay, so we want to defeat that guy, but maybe not till we have multiple attacks or something? Oh. What does Boiling Blood do? Deal two damage. Hmm. So let's do... Let's see, we have five. Let's try this. We don't need the boomerang just yet. Do this. Boy, there's a vacancy in row. The enemy behind will move forward. That's why I went with this one. The enemy who has just moved needs to wait a turn to launch an attack. If the circle showing the attack power is green, it indicates that the enemy is ready to attack. If it's black, it means the enemy won't attack this turn. Ah, and I leveled up. Nice. So we can upgrade and get a card reward, eh? Go Ballistic. Unplayable. This card is discarded. Add three Boiling Blood cards to your hand. Ooh! Since I'm about to play my boomerang, uh, that seems great. I would like to check the other ones out, though. Deal four damage. Can attack enemies in the middle row. That's pretty good. If we're taking out that one dude we don't like. Draw four cards from your block pile, then discard one card. Well, let's go ballistic. Yeah. Okay, because we're about to do this. To the rat soldier. Actually, what's boiling blood even do? Deal one damage. Okay. So, yeah. Oh, I don't have that card right now. Yeah. <laughs> oh, dear. So this is the life pile. Do I draw from the life pile? It doesn't really say, does it? Block pile, life pile. Hmm. So I might not be able to get that card like I'd hoped. Well. Hmm. I guess we just make sure we can KO the rat. Yeah, I drew the boomerang and then away we went. These two are going to attack me. When you're attacked, the enemy will take your cards. A card counts as one point of damage. Okay, first we'll first take cards at random from your block pile. If there are no cards in your block pile, they will take cards at random from your life pile. When you lose all your cards, you lose. Okay. So I should have focused on the guys attacking me. I was just thinking I could get this mouse switch before it was too late go ballistic so we have to be able to discard that and now i don't know if we can oh well okay we'll do that do that and this guy is like an assassin type range agile flying ant okay uh, oh i can get a level up reward Ooh. And if we discard it... So clearly there's a discard thing going on. Hmm. And Boiling Blood. Ooh, Crushing Blow is also very good. Hmm. I think we go for Crushing Blow, actually. As much as I'd like to go for a discard. Style. Can I discard you on purpose? No. My sadness is great. Okay, but now we have the Crushing Blow. So this, deal six damage as the attack kills the enemy out of boiling blood for each excess damage. So I think we actually just go for this guy. Ooh. Okay, so we can get props by defeating somebody with a treasure chest. Rat thief. Huh? Hmm. So we can attack him immediately when it enters the front row. Interesting. Okay, 
and then we have strikes. We can only afford to play two. So we'll take out this person. The flying ants are ready to attack me. That's not great for me. So weep. Discard two cards. Ah, okay. Now we see. We can gain energy with Master Stroke. Cross cut plus. Deal two damage. Finishing move. Deal two damage to all enemies in the front row. Oh, and it's the last card in hand. Ooh. That's going to be hard to make sure of. Uh, I kind of want Master Stroke. Is that only for the front? Yeah, it's only for the front, though. Hmm. Let's take... Well, you know what? We're kind of going for the discard. I should probably ensure we do have more discards for that go ballistic. Otherwise, it's just a dead card, period. Okay, yeah, and now we don't get what we want. Oh, well. Uh, we can take out the ant. Boop. 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 And then I can sweep. Now, let's try it. Since I only... Okay, and it still works even if you only discard one card. So that's not so bad. Okay. Hmm, we don't have much life left. We can get Boiling Blood, we can use the Boomerang. Let's use the Boomerang on the Ant. Discard, go Ballistic. It's three more attacks. Excellent. We will Boiling Blood the Ant. We'll use one on that guy. Boiling Blood again. I wonder if there's a hand size limit or not. So does this thing have... Okay, yeah, it has defense, but that's fine. We have Boiling Blood. But this guy is more of an issue. So like that. Okay, and we can actually take out that Rat Thief. Hmm. Killing Spree. Deal four damage to a random enemy in the front row. This attack kills an enemy. Repeat this effect. That seems really good. Burst into anger. Discard one card from your hand. Add three boiling blood cards to your hand. Yeah, we're going for the discard, so... Okay. Uh, to ensure we don't get two damage here, we'll go for this guy, because we can't take out the guy on the right yet. Okay. Alright. Burst into anger, so we want to do stuff with that. Hmm. Two, two... Still has iron defense, huh? Go for this guy. Discard you. Right? Oh. Uh, oops. Okay. Hmm. Well, now we have strikes. So we can take out this guy and see what happens. What do you have again? You lose energy? Ah. So we did that. Looked like we gained health from that. When you knock him to the ground, he shouts, Let me go! I can give you something good. Open the small bag, gain 30 gold coins. Drink strong potion. Ooh, all attack cards gain plus one damage. Ignore, get a special prop. Probably a property? Hmm. I kind of want to drink a strong potion, because clearly we're doing a lot of attacks, especially with our boiling blood. And if those all count as an attack... That means we do double the damage with those. So I think that'll be pretty good. But we'll see. Oh, my block cards. They gone. Hmm, so crushing blow. One blowing blood card. Actually, we get two. Let's try it. And they do deal two damage. Oh, that's beautiful. So we do that. We do that because we can. And get another boil of blood. Uh, this guy's dealing a ton of damage, so we need to work on that. And we'll boil him blood again. There we go. Got some more cards out of it. Alright, killing spree. That could be good. Discard one card. Deal three damage. Oh, but we've upgraded it with our property of the potion, so we're fine. Draw one card from the target. Uh, no, we'll take you. We're kind of doing our weird discard thing. Uh, what do you potentially have? Oh, after it attacks, it gains power. That's not good. And Ghost in... You have a treasure chest, so I want you... Okay. Nothing in the middle row anymore. 
Uh, we want to burst into anger so we can discard go ballistic. Oh, beautiful. Oh, a lot. Very beautiful. Um. I think I want to boomerang. In case I can draw. Aha. Yeah, more powerful card than boiling blood. Okay, so then we can do three here. Three, three, two. Three, three, two. Elite enemy defeated. Prop acquired. Fireworks. When you level up for card rewards, deal two damage to a random enemy. Okay. Yeah, I think the plus one attack power was definitely worth it in that case. We're going to try to take out this flying ant. That's right. Okay. Hmm. We'll start dealing damage to the big guy. That must be the boss. Rat General. Ooh. Oh. That's not great. Hmm. Yeah, when the music changes, pay attention. Hmm. Okay. So let's kill this elite enemy that keeps getting stronger. Reckless Strike, discard one card, deal four. So three, 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 four. It's 13. Okay, let me boomerang see what we get. We get the blood and blood. Ooh, perfect. Discard you. That's exactly what I wanted. Okay, so three, three, and four is perfect for KOing this person. And then we can discard a boiling blood. You get a little red crystal from a monster. It smells sweet. You decide to eat it. Randomly change two cards. Throw it. Ooh, deal six damage to everything. Yes. And because these guys are a little bit smaller on stuff, we're going to split our damage there in case we get, like, our sweep attack. Which did not happen, but we do have boiling blood. So we will do that. Okay, I can burst into anger here. So that is worthwhile. We get rid of one boiling blood and turn it into three. A little weird, but we'll do it. And now this guy pops up. Uh, red back. Draw three cards. Sweet. Let's get the red back. Okay. So he's at 28 health. Uh, once he engages... Hmm. After it attacks, it goes to the middle row. Okay. So it's not attacking yet, so we really want to deal damage to it. Which, you know, we are doing. So... I guess we'll figure it out. It shouldn't... Yeah, it's going to summon dudes here if I don't deal with it. Okay. Crushing Blow is 7 damage. But if we can get more small attacks, that's actually better. So we'll sweep here. Yeah, because for 3 energy, we can deal 9 damage instead of 7. Strike. Strike. Oh, we're so close, but not close enough. We will take damage, which is okay. Now, we can't use the Crushing Blow anymore, so we will discard you. Boiling Blow doesn't matter. I'm going to turn down the epic music. There we go. Okay, sorry about that. So, we'll see. I don't think he's going to heal just yet. No, we need to make it through, though. Or else he will heal. He basically consumed the Ratman. Gain equal attack power and health, equal to their total attack power and health. Yeah. So, what are we going to do? Is strike with great vengeance. Boiling blow. Ah, oh, okay, so he does that by doing... Okay, do that. Six plus three is nine. Okay, so he's not attacking right now. Do I want to go ahead and draw cards or no? I mean, do I have boiling blood in here? I have go ballistic. So yeah, there's no real good chance that I can draw into something that I want. Boomerang on the other end. There we go. I can discard you, get some boiling blood for no reason. <laughs> Unless this keeps going. 
Let's keep going. Victory, pick one gear. Golden key. Upgrade one random attack card. Hand of Midas. Card rewards will have two additional cards to choose from. That's cool. Each time you shuffle your life pile, gain two energy. That seems pretty good, too. Um. Hmm. I'm not sure. Let's go with Monster Hive. More energy is good. Okay, now we're in the store. Okay. So, Reckless Strike. Discard one card, deal three damage. Eternal Blood. Add two Boiling Blood cards to your hand. When you play a Boiling Blood card during this turn, draw a card. <laughs> uh, yes. We buy you. Bloodletting. Discard any number of cards and add that many Boiling Blood cards to your hand. Finishing move. Add two Boiling Blood cards to your hand. Hmm. That's interesting. I don't think we want that, though. Roar. Now, see, this one's easy to play as the last card because it has zero energy. Hmm. Interesting. Stargazer, look at the top three cards of your life pile. That's actually pretty good, I think. Killing Spree is interesting. Burst into Anger. We still got 82 money. Oh, we can gain stuff for the future. Or we can upgrade. Ooh. So we can make that better. We can make this deal an extra damage. Red bag. Draw four cards. Deal eight damage. Okay, so that's plus two damage. Hmm. I like this because we pretty much always can use that. Reckless strike. What about you? That's plus two damage. Hmm. Boomerang. Eternal blood. Hmm. I do like you as well, Eternal Blood. Hmm. Let's go with this one, though. It's kind of our best card, I think. We can still upgrade if we want. We can delete a card as well. So what's bad here? Sweep doesn't necessarily work well with this. Hmm. But it's not terrible. But it is extensive. So I would probably get rid of Sweep. But... Let's get rid of a strike. Let's upgrade another thing. Like you. Then we can delete another... No, that's not it. There it is. Okay. So once again, cards are life, though. So there's kind of a... Good and bad at that. Ooh, that would have been good. Oh, well. Next! Okay, we do have a level up. So throwing dagger, zero cost, that's not bad. We can get eternal blood again. <laughs> hmm. Yeah, we'll go ahead and get you. I should check to sacrifice, but oh well. Um. Hmm. So I think we use you to beat the tar out of that thing and get a couple boiling bloods. You, get rid of that guy. We don't need to draw more cards, do we? Nah. Right? Yeah, we can't afford any more, really, anyway. Uh, and with Rebirth, it gains plus attack power. Okay. Hmm. Only dealing one damage? Oh, so that one potion is now gone. That's right. Okay. So we can deal two and two. Get another thing going. Wait, what happens when you engage? Oh, that's bad. Um, I should have gone for the other one first, but I will. Doesn't matter. Uh, and we will go for this guy next. In Dark Tree. Okay. Burst into anger. Go Ballistic Plus! <laughs> we can fit all those cards, it's beautiful. Okay, Reckless Strike. That is worthwhile. Discard one of these Boiling Bloods. There we go. Okay, and this thing shouldn't matter because we've already played cards now. 
So we'll do a strike. Another strike. You're out of here. And then we got what, six left? So we can do this. And then still deal some damage. Uh oh. What just happened? Okay, it can just attack us from there. That's fine. And you equal to its health, eh? Hmm. We'll decrease that a little bit, just in case. Alright, so we're taking a little bit of damage. Return of blood. Okay. That's pretty good. So we will do it. Nani. Uh, eternal blood. Add two boiling blood cards to your hand. Where are you? Did I, like, discard that instead of play it? No, I played it. Well, that's annoying. Hmm. Okay, well, we take out the fierce dog. Um, what else do we get? Eternal blood, which I guess it just doesn't work. Finishing move effects can trigger without meeting their conditions. Ooh, that's cool. But no. Deal five damage, draw one card. Ooh. That's only if it's the last card in your hand. Which could work. We're just going to skip, though. Get some gold. Hmm. So we can only deal three damage now. Who do we attack? I think we attack the big person. Because these mummies are just dealing one damage at a time right now. But once we take them down, they deal three. So, we'll do this. Okay. Interesting. So... Will Eternal Blood work this time? Seriously? Okay, as far as I can tell, it does not seem to work. Which is really annoying. Hmm. What's your special ability? Oh, that's bad. Um, hmm. Because I really want to sweep. But then we'd have to discard two cards. Um. Let's do the boomerang first, then. We'll go for this guy. Get rid of you. Burst into anger. Uh, we'll discard you, I guess. Okay. I think this will be worth it. In theory. So. One. A two. A one. A two. I kill all of you. And then only that one person's attacking. So, kind of the same amount of damage. Yeah, well. Go Ballistic. We want to get rid of you. So let's use our red bag. Really? Oh, that's right. This thing stops our first card each turn. I need to remember that. Because clearly I have issues. Ha ha ha. Okay. Hmm. We can still Crushing Blow. So yeah, let's do that on this dude. Okay. We can take out one of you. And then not quite enough damage. Oh! The lost soul approaches you, pleading. Hug me. Extinguish, gain more coins. Ignore it, gain 10 XP. Embrace it. Get one Val card. What's a Val card? I want to know. Ooh. Can you show me? Skill card, gain 1 XP and 2 gold. Oh! So it has to pay off over time. Well, that's not so bad. Okay, well, we can't KO that thing. We're going to take a lot of damage. That's not great. Uh, but it's not the worst thing ever, right? I mean, we could die right here. That's not great either. Uh, let's just kind of split the damage there. Okay, good. We blocked most of that. Okay, so we can Vow for free. That's also a good discard card, I guess. Oh yeah, they're not blocking my eternal blood. <laughs> okay, now we know. Uh, boomerang. I'll take you down. That gives us some more cards and stuff. Uh, we will discard you for now. We only have two energy, though, so I should discard the other thing. Oh, whoops. 
We'll do that. Uh, and then, of course, we do this to decrease the amount of damage that guy can deal. What do you do? Musketeer range, front line, enemies behind this enemy gain range. Uh, hmm. All cards in this enemy's body are moved into the body of a random enemy in the same realm. Okay. Well then. We're alive! That's good. Okay, so we can use our boomerang here. Take you down a notch. Go ballistic. Take you down another notch. Or actually, let's vow real fast. Hmm. I'm just thinking. I would like to get rid of this guy, then have this guy enter this row and go into something weak. Then we can get all those cards. But I don't know if we're going to be able to do that. I don't think we can. We don't have the damage here. So I'll just have to decrease the amount of damage incoming. And I think we're going to end on Reckless Strike. Yeah, we've got the energy. Okay, so we're going to do that. Get rid of that. We can then use our dude right there. Okay. Get that. All right. Oh, other enemies gain iron defense. Well, wish I'd read that more carefully. Okay. Consume all your remaining energy, then deal X damage and add X blood. Oh, okay. Well, that's not bad for us. That's also not bad for us. Blood contract. Hmm. Also not bad for us. Hmm. Is this to one person or to everyone? Huh. Let's do that. It just seems fun. Okay, then. So we've only got one dude really attacking. Uh, so we will spend this here. And then we have choices. I think we spend our boiling blood on Big Boy over here. Because it would have done one damage regardless. Then we do that. And our turn. Okay. Hmm. So nobody's blocking our cards this turn. So we could Eternal Blood. But I think what I want to do is actually strike Crushing Blow. Enemy defeated. Ooh, more gold. Confirm. Uh, are you also... No, you're increasing attack power. Okay. Hmm. Well, then. Hmm. So we're definitely doing this, I think. Because that'll decrease his attack. Nobody else that we attack will really decrease the attack. So we'll do that. Ah, we decreased it down to one because the attack power of this enemy is equal to its health. So this doesn't matter. Interesting. Okay. Yeah, we're losing a bunch of cards, though. <laughs> oh, dear. All right, so we can Boiling Blow. I think that was worth it. Do we do this? Can I only target one dude? Looks like it. Hmm. So we can deal six and gain six. So 12 total. And then we have that other one. I think that's worth it. Uh, let's make sure we take out the flying ant. Hmm. Apparently won't let me attack. What about you? Huh. I don't know why it's not letting me attack. But apparently it's not. Okay. Okay, well, I could do that. That's weird. Well, I guess I shouldn't knock it. It's something. Okay. But it was wasted energy and damage. Oh, is this... Yeah, it's taunting me. Okay. Protecting everybody else. Okay. Hmm. 
Alright then, this has not been the best round played. We deal 7 damage, but we have a taunter. Let's get a... actually, we're gonna do this. We're gonna discard our vow. Hmm. Let's do this. Take out that guy. Okay. The Musketeers stands down. Thanking you for your bravery and offering to help you. So you can tap and do that. Fire the musket. Kill all non-boss enemies. Take his musket. Get his musket. Uh, let's get the musket. What's that do? When an elite enemy or boss enemy enters the front row, deal six damage to them. That seems really good. Okay. So, we have some options here. I think we kill the flying ant so we get some more cards. Now, one dude attacking isn't very tough. Ah, oh, there we go. Whew. A lot of cards. So, yeah, we get all the cards back that that thing took from us. <laughs> okay, and this guy's taunting. So, we will attack that. Okay. Hmm. Burst into anger. Well, what's eternal blood first? Do we want to draw more cards? Nah. I don't think we need them. Especially since we can only afford two more things anyway. Let's see. That's two damage. A little reckless strike. The taunt guy. Boink. And then we can do... Let's see. We've got five here? Yeah. So that's not enough. Boink. Okay. Oh, that's right. We draw more cards for every time. We play a boiling blood. Totally forgot about that. Oh well. Um, we can take out you. Okay, we got this. Energy potion. That is free. Blistering blood. Ooh, yes, we want you. Okay, and then we can play you for free. So we will. And then, yeah, we got all these parasite guys. Okay. So we kind of want to kill them all at the same time. And we want all these Boiling Blood cards in our hand before we play Blistering Blood, right? Yeah. Or I guess it doesn't matter. Hmm. Um, we'll do this. Do this. Hmm. We want to end with Sweep. Let's do strike. Reckless strike means we have to discard something. Still better than playing this then. Uh, so yeah, we will do that. Conflame. And then we will sweep. I'm gonna take a ton of damage though, which isn't great. Okay. We can bloody storm. Let's do eternal blood. Burst into anger. Go to the strike. There we go. Then we have more cards to play around with. Uh, we can boomerang or we can bloody storm. Do we have... No, we do not. Hmm. Okay, so bloody storm it is, I think. So two damage, and then we get more bloody bowling cards. Uh, okay, so let's do this. One, two. Oh, good. It went underneath that guy. One, two, three, four, five, six. That's not good enough, so we have to do this. So this way we get more cards back. So we won't die immediately. <laughs> Okay, we get two more energy back for reshuffling our life pile. So we can do a strike. A strike. Boop. Bop. Okay. Uh, we will do this and that. And hope we don't die. Yeah. Okay. So with this, I'm actually going to do that. 
Oh. I should have checked this engage. Summon a dog prince behind this enemy after this enemy attacks. Dog prince gains plus one attack power. That's not good. Okay. Well, guess we're just going to deal the damage to you. The dog king. All right, dog king. Okay, so he's going to attack this turn. That's not great for us. So eternal blood is good if we can get more blood cards. Let's look for him. Ooh. Okay, we'll do that. Hmm. Let's look. Can we find what we want? Ah, and we get more energy that way, so that's even better. Hmm. We don't want to sweep then. Let's go ahead and do this. I think I'm doing this correctly. I'm not sure. And this full. We should get more energy. Yep. Okay, so we're going to do that. Gain more energy. Oh my gosh. I think we may have figured out an infinite combo. Maybe. Uh, boiling blood. Okay. Well, we have plenty of energy, so we're going to strike. Okay, boiling blood. That's eternal blood, but that works as well. We just need more of these. Okay. Oh, I drew two... Co oh, okay. So, hilarious. <laughs> okay. So we may have an infinite. Seems to be working. Okay. And we eternal blood again, so that I have access to more boiling blood. Okay, and now we have to make our way through this. And the dog prince. Okay, let's go through our vow. We'll gain some more money and stuff that way. Um, I deal 8 and 8. He doesn't have anything protecting him. So yeah, let's just uh, think about doing that, shall we? We can boomerang. Get rid of go ballistic. Which is rather hilarious. Um, where's my card that gives me... Ah, blistering blood. It's still in there. So just to try to find Blistering Blood, I would like to do this. For the strikes. Tisk. Eternal Blood. Hmm. I can burst into anger. Get rid of the red bag. Okay. There you are. Beautiful. Okay. Mm-hmm. Now we gain two energy. Right? Yes. Okay. So not exactly infinite, but pretty close. And we got a lot of use out of Vow then. Uh, and then I think we just want to do that. Yes. And we gained a level. Yay! So, that worked. Crystal Ball, start of your turn. Oh! At the start of your turn, gain one additional energy. Maximum cost of all cards is reduced to four energy. So if you had a huge card or something. When you're in the store, upgrade one random skill card. That seems pretty good, too. But I like more energy. Let's do that. That also would help us play more cards, so we could potentially buy stuff that helps us do that. But wow, I think this is enough for one episode, dear viewer. Leave a like if you've enjoyed Dark Mist. Subscribe for more Iris Gaming videos. Comment below on whether you think this is a good dick for the Berserker or not. And I hope you have a great day.